Looney Farm Guy here, and this is Lizard Animal Barns by Mr. Hector on Farming Simulator 22. It's for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here on Rock Crawl for this test of four animal barns, which include a pig barn, sheep barn, horse stable, and chicken coop. Not necessarily in that order, as this first one is, as you can see, a horse barn. It's just because that's how they come up in the construction menu, so I thought it would be... Uh, logically arranged that way so we have the four barns here and we'll go through them quickly to start with and you'll find them first so animals and no cow barn which is odd but no car barn horses uh, 12 slots on console we have hundred and fifty eight thousand dollars we get to change the color, if you like, left and right on the D-pad. 16 horses, a uh, basic horse barn. Uh, nothing different in what, except for straw. It, well, you know what, it takes straw and I, um, we're gonna put down a silo, but I, yeah, we're gonna put down a silo because we can and because it has straw, but I highly doubt it makes manure because horse manure is not a, a base game. Yeah, um, straw bales go here. So yes, bales. Uh, here is your animal, the animal icon. Let's get our help window on here. There we go. Uh, animal dialogue actually has a little picture of a horsey on it, which is custom, obviously, because, well, that's not base game. Uh, these doors open and close. Inside, L3 will turn on the lights. Yes, I bought all gray horses just because I'm lazy. Um, and gates all open and close. What doesn't open and close is this gate there. Or that door. This door does. Uh, this door doesn't. So there's an enclosed area which you can't get into, oddly enough. Food, I will show all these things. Food, water is automatic. Food goes here. So oats, I gave them oats. Standard horse food stuff. Right, moving on quickly to the pig barn. Pig barn you'll find under animals and pigs. And there it is, $209,000, 300 pigs. And this also you can change the color. Lots of different colors. Um, food goes in here. You can open and close this. It doesn't matter if it's opened or closed. You can put food in. I'll show you that. Um, again, straw in bales can go here or loose straw if you want to use a blower. Uh, again, this door doesn't open, turning the lights on and off with the L3 anywhere. Outside lights and or heat lamps if there is any will be automatically turned on um, at night. So pigs have slurry. Let's uh, take a run around. So food goes in here. That's where the bales go. Here is the animal dialogue. Again, a little piggy. This little piggy went to market, 300 pigs. Food, pig food, or however you want to mix the... No, that's, that's straw. Oh, this is where you blow the straw in. That's what that, I was wondering what that icon was. The straw blow icon. I have set up a manure pit, and here is the slurry output. I presume we're going to test all of that. Next up for uh, testing is the sheep barn. Sheep barn is found under animals and sheep 197. Again, you can change the color by left and right on your D pad. Sheep are really simple. Here's a little sheep icon where you get your sheep 300 sheep there they are all the doors open and close interior lights l3 uh, food goes in here either bales or loose grass or hay both will work running around back the wool should appear over here I, go, I climbed up there, but that door doesn't open. Neither does this door open. I will show capacities in a moment. And finally, the chickens. Again, food in here. 
eggs should appear here. Turn on the lights, L3. And in here, I do believe is automatic. Anywhere that you can't turn on lights is going to be automatic. And look at that little chicken. 500 chickens. That should be quite a few chickens. Uh, so let's take a look at them in our animal dialogue here. At the top is the pigs, 60,000 liters of food. Or sorry, 110,000 liters of food, 60,000 liters of straw. Sheep, 60,000 liters of food. Chicken, 110,000 liters of food. And for the horses, 23,000 liters of food and 20,000 liters of straw. Straw, we'll see uh, what that actually does, if anything. Right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go forward one month and we'll see if any of them run out of food and see if they produce anything. And then I will show you where all the uh, food and straw and all that goodies go inside. So we'll see in a bit. Bye, and let's look at our horses. Horses, let's see, food barely went down at all and they used some straw. Strange. Let's look at the chickens and sheep. Yeah, okay, so there's things going away. Oh, excuse me, I had to sneeze all of a sudden. That would have been terribly bad. Right, so what about, man no, no manure. So it's using up straw, but where it's going or what it's going being used for is anyone's guess. So um, yeah, no worries about food capacity or well, straw. Straw goes in here. Yeah, it took what little bit of straw it used in uh, there. So. Yeah, food, did they even eat? Yeah, they ate a little bit. Uh, I'll show you where the food goes in. Um, yeah, so massive quantities of food reserves. You'll never, uh, you fill it up, you won't run out for many, 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 many months. So there we go. Standard, um, standard feed that any horse, you just look at the description, it'll tell you what they eat. Food goes in there, right, so. Uh, moving on to the pigs. So let me get some pig food. Okay, pig barn. Let's take a look. Food, lot, still 92,000 and straw. So food and straw, and we have slurry. So that is good. We have manure, so it's collecting the manure with the base game manure pit. If we spin around back, I'll show you where the food goes in. So notice it's closed, that's not a problem. It will still take food even though it's closed, like so. Very generous uh, trigger. Right, so that's good. Also straw with bales, again, you could use a blower or just throw the bales here. And we'll show you that. There we go. Yes, it took straw. It did take it, there's only 75 liters left in this one. And there we go, you see the straw is full to capacity. So now, let's get in our tanker and see if the slurry trigger works. Start filling, yes, slurry works. So, there we go. Now, let's, um, let's jump over to the sheep, shall we? And sheep, yes, sheep take grass. This is a grass bale and if we run over here to the, oh, it's filled up some. So if we, sorry, uh, there was, so you can see they used some food. They used up some grass. Grass goes in here, but there is plenty of grass to be, yes. Uh, capacity, no, no risk of running out. And we have wool, plenty of wool here as well. Very nice. Last but not least, chickens. Chickens uh, barely ate any food at all. Same thing here, food goes in there. We'll put a little bit of food in there just to show you where it goes. There it goes, just like that. If you're having trouble putting food in, perhaps uh, something is blocking, as in did you use the toggle free mode to place it down? What do I mean by toggle free mode? 
when you place anything down you can press the triangle and that means if there is a undulation or a rough if the ground is not is not even and you place this down in toggle free mode this trigger area might be underground and it won't work just a little tip eggs eggs are produced here look there there we go we have eggs and that that's it eggs produced food in eggs out that's all that chickens do really and yeah so there you go everything seems to work work well there is plenty of food capacity everything is produced eggs and wool are produced manure is manure and slurry is produced where necessary and that's it the lizard animal barns by mr hector on farming simulator 22 thank you all for watching and remember it's only a game so till next time bye for now